Good morning, we are so excited to be here. It is our first full day here and it is gonna be a beautiful day. It's gonna be warm, it's supposed to be 80 degrees. Today is the full conference day for Disney Creator Celebration, so I'm getting ready to head back this morning. And the kids and Dan are gonna to go to Epcot and ride some rides. They're gonna meet up with me to do a showcase in the afternoon. Uh, but it should be a really exciting day. We're just, I feel so much better after a great night's sleep. The room's super comfortable. I cannot wait to do a room tour for you guys. Normally I would have done that right when we got here, but since I had to basically run in, change clothes, and go straight to an event, I haven't had time yet, but I will have a room tour. But we have just had the best time already. You can see from our room, you can see the grounds here. It's just before seven o'clock. I'm getting ready to head down at seven o'clock and meet the buses to go over to where all the creators that are here are having breakfast and then going to the general session. We're actually going to um, the contemporary is where we're gonna have the conference today. So I'm really excited about that. But it's really neat to sit here and watch the Skyliner at night. You can even see it moving off in the distance. There is the Tower of Terror at Hollywood Studios. And if we're here one of the evenings, hopefully we'll be able to see some fireworks at night too. So uh, it's just been really good to get in and get settled. So for the general conference this morning, we'll hear from a number of different speakers and we'll get to hear from Disney Parks. We'll get to hear about new and exciting upcoming things. I'm excited about that. And then this afternoon, we'll go to the showcase. We'll get to see new merchandise, new items that are coming out and talk to a number of different companies there. And then we have a break this afternoon, which I'm gonna to try to come back into the room for then. Um, but then we're also gonna to go to the parks as a family. And then tonight we are watching the Happily Ever After fireworks show. And here's Isabella, she wants to show her shirt. So we got this shirt at Target. She's loving the meme shirts. <laughs> it says, this is so Isabella. It says, keeping it casual, also me, ball gown. <laughs> Which I, I you can kind of see it in the mirror, but I'm also dressed inspired by Cinderella today I've got a blue dress on I've got some sparkly comfortable you. Nike shoes and um, We are celebrating Cinderella's 70th, 70th anniversary oh, wow. is going on right now if Those are hidden Mickeys. I really don't know how Bella's on a stuff. quest to find hidden Mickeys right now So she's looking all hidden around Mickey's the resort Mickey's trying to find hidden, hidden Mickeys, Mickey's. Oh on the windows, I see. Hold on, I'll zoom in so you can see too. It's all about the details. That's so fun. So I'm gonna go get my stuff gathered to head to the conference and then I'm gonna meet up with these guys later so we can go have some fun. And hopefully at some point we'll get a chance to try that pool out too. So it's a busy day, it's a busy trip and we've got lots of fun ahead and we are just ready to dive in and Take There's the second one. Natalie's in classic Mickey today. She's got her mini ears on and a Mickey ice cream cone. Oh, I could stay out here all morning, but I gotta go get my stuff together. So normally I try to do room tours before we get our stuff in and get the place destroyed, but you're not gonna get a room tour like that on this trip because we had to get in and get going yesterday. But I'll do a full room tour in the in a separate video later, but it's so awesome. This bed pulls down, obviously, and Natalie slept here last night. That's okay, I'll show it in the room tour. This pulls down well, into a little bed. Me. That was well, sisters. There's a full kitchen here. I have to just show the bathroom. You're gonna get a little mini tour while I go get my stuff. I am bringing this backpack with me today and this little card case. That's from Box Lunch. I really want them. <laughs> <laughs> and then going through the bathroom, there's two entries. There's a sink over here. There's a rain shower, which everyone's been enjoying in there. And it goes all the way back and has a seat. There's a giant tub so you can come have a nice bath after you've been in the parks all day long. And here's all my junk all over inside. I normally try to do videos before you see all that, but this is what you're getting this time. Oh, let's go over and show you my outfit. <clears throat> so here's more of our junk and I've got stuff hung up in the closet. But this is my dress inspired by Cinderella, some sparkly Nikes, and wanna then we've show, got wanna show we use this sweater to put over it. You want me to show you something that I think is crazy? Yes, she show me what you think is crazy. And everything goes in a circle, by the way, too. Oh, and there's a washer and dryer, and an ironing board. That goes to someone else's room. We don't want to open that. 
But over here, there is a washer and dryer. Okay, so here is my whole outfit. I've got this little cardigan on over it, and I'm gonna head downstairs to go catch the bus. I said I'm Brett Island. I, I have always dreamed of working for Disney and being a Disney animator. Um, and it would it'd be my dream just to sharpen pencils and learn the tips of the, uh, the trade from Disney animators. Sent it off, and uh, you know, I'm sure my little nine year old self didn't think much of it, but a month later I got a response. And it was a really thick envelope, actually mailed from here, from Florida. Um, somehow it got to the animation studio here in Florida. And um, a gentleman wrote me back and he gave me the building blocks of how to achieve this career that I so much wanted. He outlined the schools I should go to, the books I should read, how to you know enhance my portfolio. And so, it, yeah, I literally voiced my dream by saying, I wanna be a Disney animator. And I you know put it into motion a little bit, but I got this great response back, which was, I recently found it when I, I did a presentation for the Walt Disney Family Museum last spring. And in gathering stuff together, I found that letter, um, and it was like trans it, it was like a time traveling experience because to think about this little Brett, you know, experiencing that, and then be like, I wish I could tell him, like, you think that's cool that you got a response from Disney Future Animation? Just wait, yeah. you're gonna be sitting yeah. on stage with Ashley Eckstein. No. Where are you from? I love when people pause about where they're from. Are you in the witness protection? Oh, I know. Well, this is the Disney Gucci collection. It's on loan. I'm sending it back. <laughs> so we're going to walk around and see a number of different exhibits at all of these beautiful cupcakes. Look who I found. They're hanging out and going all around to the different booths with me. They're taking a quick cupcake break. Get one of the Cinderella cupcakes and it matches Isabella's shirt. Now she's wearing her. You're so blue. You've got blue all over your face. And we are walking around to the different areas. We've already hit up Gobo Squeeze. So we are heading out from the different conference events for the day. I've met up with these guys and we're gonna head out and catch the bus and then go change clothes and then head to the parks for a little bit. These guys have already been at Epcot today. And we're gonna go to Magic Kingdom. We had a rest at the room for a little bit and we're gonna go explore Riviera Resort for a few minutes and then we are heading to Magic Kingdom tonight. Exploring the boardwalk. Is this two? So you can see that there's artwork all around in the hallways. And there's the view onto the back. So this is the lobby area. And we're going to go downstairs and go outside. Bella's already got ahead. So this is technically the first floor. Down by the pool and the walking area that we can see. It looks like the Skyliner stopped over there. Decided is that there's a difference between it just slowing down. It just kind of pauses occasionally. So this is the view from down below. So our room is actually up there on that side. You can see there's one of the eating places, Primo Fiato and Topolino's Terrace. We have reservations there. And our last day actually here, our last full day, we have breakfast reservations that morning. So there's the pool that you can see from our room over there. And then over here, 
this is around the corner from our room. There's another pool with a water slide and a fountain. And different activities over here. I'm just taking a quick walk around the resort to kind of check things out. They've had a chance to see everything, but I haven't really had a chance to look around too much. There's the pool. And we're going to head over here past the pool that we can see from our room and go check out the murals. And then we're heading to Magic Kingdom so we can go ride some rides. And the weather is pretty much perfect because it's just a little bit overcast and it's like 80 degrees. It feels really good. And this is the quiet pool that we can see from our room. And I really wish I had a And the Skyliner station is over here. These guys have rode the Skyliner. I have not rode it. I have not ridden it yet. You don't want to look down, but I looked down. You looked down? Times. Were you really high? Uh huh. Yeah. Worst way to die. <laughs> Where do you because they've got Epcot and they got caravan. Oh yeah. So here oh, is the fun. mosaic over here. These are Rapunzel's tower on this side, and then there is, and then this one has Big Ben, goes all the way up and around, off Neverland, and Neverland on that side. This side has. Rapunzel's lanterns all the way up and around. They come down at Rapunzel's tower. dinner first and then we're gonna go ride some rides all right Bella's on a hit no everyone's gonna go get dinner we just have to go get your sister first come on come over here real quick
heading to Tomorrowland to go eat dinner real quick. And then we're gonna go ride a couple rides. Ready to go eat? Yeah. Yeah? Then have my car and start home. So we are grabbing a quick dinner at Cosmic Ray's Starlight Cafe. The kids got Mickey kids meals. There is mac and cheese and some chicken nuggets. Dan got the plant-based burger and I got the Greek salad with chicken. Oh, is it? Oh, sorry, it's not a burger, it's Sloppy Joe's. And then this is our view. You can see the castle at the window, so we're gonna eat and then go ride some. Yeah. We are heading over to Seven Doors Mine Train. How about we do Seven Doors Mine Train before we spin ourselves around right after eating? <laughs> Little ducks in a Disney row.
early morning and we are going to be back here after we are back from the cruise and hopefully be able to do a few more rides. There's a lot of people trying to get out at one time right now. Troopers the past couple days we're getting tired. We got up at 3 a.m. yesterday and I think 6 a.m. for them today. So it's been two early days in a row. Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, in just 10 minutes, Cinderella Castle will come. And that is it for our night. We are headed to the Bus de Riviera Resort. See you tomorrow for another Disney vlog.